Hello everyone, this is Lewis, and I am doing my first ever Let's Play. Now, uh, because I've never done a because I've never done a Let's Play before, I'm sure that you can expect a lot of technical difficulties, a lot of just awkward everything's, and uh, just general terribleness. And before we get started, I just want to let you know uh, if you're wondering what game I'm playing, it is Animorphs Shattered Reality, which is a game that well, you just saw the title of it. Uh, it's a game that I grew up um, playing. Well, that makes it sound like I played it for a very long time. I did not. I played it once and never touched it again uh, when I was a small child, because I was a fan I of Animorphs, an and I'm going to let the Elemus talk. Since the dawn of time, I have observed every detail of the universe. My interests have taken me far and wide, studying beings on worlds throughout the cosmos. Recently, my attention has been drawn to a conflict on a small blue world known as this. Oh, hey, I recognize that planet. Ruthless aliens called the Yurk have begun an invisible invasion, Ugh. taking control of human That's minds. Gross. Turning them into oh, they do that. slaves. Oh, slaves, that's not good. But now, everything has changed. Everything? The Yurk leader, Vizzer Three. Oh, he's not really the leader. Control but... of a okay. Powered by a continuum crystal. Ah, oh, continuum crystal. What'd that do? But the weapon was more powerful than expected. The How powerful exploded. did he think it was? It shattered reality itself. Not reality. Only one thing stands between the Yurk and ultimate huh? victory. No! Ah, yes. I believe, I believe they, I believe these are the that they're, they're talking about. Makes sense because they're morphing into, into animals, as you, as you see. Uh, yeah, those, are, those are definitely animals. A group of young heroes called the Animorphs. Also, Axe has like a 12-pack there. That's great. <laughs> anyway, so, um, so yes, I, uh, I have not played this game in years, uh, so it's going to be fun. going to be a lot of fun here. Uh, I'm going to start a new game, although I did just do a test run, and uh, so it's going to find stuff, and I'm going to overwrite it, and I have no qualms about this whatsoever. All right. Now, new game. We're going to start at the entrance, uh, and hopefully I'm not going to suck so much. I get to choose my character. I see that. Uh, I am... I'm going to choose Marco, uh, because Marco is a character that I always kind of identified with, um, you know, being that he was kind of the wisecracking, sort of, not really leader dude, but, because I, I, I was never a leader uh, when, I was, when I was growing up um, in any capacity, uh, official or unofficial, uh, and so I always identified with the, uh, the sort of sidekicky type, uh, that being Marco. Ow! Feel your pain, Marco. That's how much I identify with you. Hey! And I'm almost dead. I have taken two steps, and I am almost dead. I really hope that these coins are doing something, but I know that they're not. I actually don't know what the coins do. I think they're just for fun. Like, I think... I don't know. Because the, the premise... We have to remember, the premise of this game is shattered reality, which... Oh. I am now a rhino. Okay. Now I am not a rhino. Now, okay, so, yeah, no sweat indeed. Um, ah, uh, okay, so shattered reality. I, from what I can tell, uh, what I've been able to surmise thus far is that what shattered reality means is that reality has gone from being the reality that you and I know and love to a platformer. When reality is cracked beyond repair, a platformer is what it becomes. Um, and not a very good platformer either. Uh, it's mostly 2.5D for a majority of the game. Ha! I just dodged those spikes. That was pretty sweet of me. Um, 
2.5D, for the most part, uh, is what reality becomes when it's shattered. Uh, you lose that 0.5 of a D. <laughs> um, yeah. um, I don't know what these things are. I don't know why they are pounding against each other. I don't know what that's if that's something Freudian, uh, maybe. But uh, overall, I don't see a point to them. Which I guess ties into the shatteredness of the reality. It's just everything happening here is just... just You have to question every every bit of reality. And I have to wonder, I have to even go so far as to wonder whether or not the Animorphs are the good guys anymore. Maybe they've become the bad guys in this shattered reality, huh? Did you ever think about that? No, you didn't. Oh! Ah, that's that. Those are lives. And this is a bug. This is a bug that someone should have fixed. But, uh, I guess they didn't. But, uh, that's fun. So. So, yeah. Um, I'm gonna take these lives. They're mine now. I mean, I'm, I'm not, not, not taking, taking lives. I mean, I have taken lives, obviously, because I just killed that, that alien back there. I took his life. But I didn't get to, I didn't get to use it as my own, as I got to use those lives as my own. Or I, I will. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. So, um, so yeah. Uh, oh, ah! Okay, I meant to do that. Um, so those little plus signs, those appear to be health. Health. What's the plural of, oh, I, I got to use it. I just hurt myself. Um, oh, I hurt myself again, and now there is no health. I think the plural of health is healths. I mean, what else would it be? Healths. That doesn't make My sense. Favorite alien. Your favorite? I don't know what those aliens were. I don't know if those guys were in the books. Or maybe they were. Someone can tell me. Yeah, don't pick on the giant rhinoceros. Pick on someone your own size. What swims in this? I don't know. So, uh, so here we are. Uh, about to hit a loading screen. And I think I'm just gonna end it here, because, you know, it's been fun, but I've hit a loading screen, and it'll probably be done by the time I'm done talking. Or, it'll probably go on. Uh, it'll probably finish before I'm done talking, because I have a lot of things to say. But anyway, I just wanted to say, uh, thank you for getting this far with me. Uh, and thank you for tolerating my ineptitude at platformers, which is strange because I love platformers. I just really suck at them. But uh, I hope to do more of these, and I will have to. Um, but I'll have to see. Um, you know, have to see. But uh, but yeah. So thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.